The National Wind Institute's Debris Impact Facility at Texas Tech University wanted to know, what's the best building material for standing up to hurricanes and tornadoes? Wood? Or concrete? Much of our work here at Texas Tech has been finding ways to improve buildings for wind resistance uh, to uh, be more resilient in the case of a windstorm. This is our debris impact cannon and we shoot the two before's at 100 miles an hour. Simulates a 250 mile an hour wind, what a 15 pound two before would fly in it. The purpose of the demonstration is to show the adequacy of some materials to re resist extreme wind debris impacts, other materials incapable of withstanding. We didn't know what to expect. We didn't know whether the concrete would crack up or not, but uh, with a 100 mile an hour, 15 pound, two by four test, that basically uh, didn't even make a dent. You see the devastation on Mexico Beach in Florida. Everything is gone except for that one structure, that one house that's standing that was made out of concrete. And so what this shows is, is basically that if you build in a resilient and a, a reasonable and a, a smart way and you invest in that infrastructure at the front, you're actually gonna be able to create something that will withstand something as, as major as a hurricane. 